and then uh, and then do this okay okay change options oh uh, yeah okay okay let's hope this works okay so far so good Okay, we got it. Nice. Where's my stylus? There it is. Hello everyone, I'm the gamer. I play what I want, where I want, whatever I have the time. This is uh, my favorite DS Zelda game. This is Spirit Tracks, The Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks. I'm here with Randall. Say hey, Randall. Hello. And yeah, so we got nothing better to do. So let's play a, uh, a uh, glitchy Zelda game. I might just have to. We might just have to play Phantom Hourglass if this doesn't work. But we'll find out. Of course, I'm gonna use my name as Link, cause you know, of course, I'm gonna do that. Yes, that's one of my character. I hold in my left hand. Yes. All right. Let's go and do this. Start and do an adventure. All right. <clears throat> in the beginning, the people followed the spirits of good and all was peaceful. But that era of peace soon came to an end. The evil demon king rose to power, destroying everything in his path. I thought that the, and, and Gandalf was the demon king, but apparently not. Apparently there's two of them. Whatever. The spirit of good had no choice but to face him in battle. The war that ensued seemed to last an eternity, and much blood was shed. Finally, the spirits subdued the Demon King, though they could not destroy him. Their powers are greatly depleted. This is not any sort of Zelda game at all. This is just backstory for this game. With their remaining power, they buried the Demon King's spirit in the ground. They built shackles to imprison him. And a tower that act as a lock, and if you'll excuse me, I gotta do a thing. There we go. These shackles cover the land to these day. This day, the train tracks. The train tracks act as the shackles, the chains that keep him in prison. Oh, cool. Yeah. With the power drain, the spirits of good returned. Uh, some suddenly, breath of both demons and spirits, this land was entrusted to us. Uh, oh God, sorry. <laughs> it went all that good. And here we go. And that's Nico, the only surviving character from uh, Wind Waker and Phantom Hourglass. How he survived and Link and Tetra didn't, I don't fucking know, but whatever. Well, well, do I know how to tell a story or what? I call it Spirits and Demons. It's war. It sounds like a sci-fi movie. <laughs> like a, like a D-grade sci-fi movie. You, know? you, yeah. you see, like, yeah. I only do this show once a year, you know. It's a blasted masterpiece. Uh, uh, <coughs> a masterpiece. A blaster piece. <laughs> a blaster piece. What's this? You fell asleep during my magnum opus? There's Link. Chilling as usual. Wake up, you sleepy bones. He looks quite pissed, actually. I can't believe this. You know, Link. A lot of people would love to be in your position. As my roommate, you get to see my work for free. Plus, I'm not getting any younger here. The story might be the only one that proves I existed. Can you pay attention for one minute? Although he wasn't here when... <laughs> Listen to old man's final creation. Oh, I just, I just realized that. He's talking bullshit. Zzz. Okay, okay, I can take a hand. Sorry for boring you. And look, here comes your mentor. Hello there, Alfonso. <laughs> he looks quite pissed too. Why are you? St why are you still here, Link? Come on, Al. Wipe the sleep out of your eyes. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Today is a very important day, you know. It's your audience with the princess. What? <laughs> 
Don't tell me you forgot. You won't amount to much if you don't pay attention. Don't you want your engineer certificate? On well, the graduation ceremony is at the castle. Princess Zelda herself is going to do the honors. I'm heading to the station now, so meet me there. Remember, the station is up the road, so don't get lost. Got it? Good. Then get a move on. <laughs> See you later, Nico. <sighs> Today is the day you graduate from a prince. Today is the day you graduate from apprentice to official trained engineer. It's quite an honor, and you mustn't be late. Use the stylus to touch where you want to go. It's as easy as that. Don't ask me what a stylus is. I'll just, I'll just say what's written. To talk to someone or use an object, just tap what you're interested in. Now off to the castle with you. Scoot! Okay. First. Pats. Gotta get those pats. Okay. About a village. <laughs> in a world. Where you do literally nothing all day long, every day. Let's see now. That's those birds. See, you, in this game, all you have to do is run and double tap. Wait, hold on. Look, I gotta do it. There we go. <laughs> Ran right into a tree. Great. Alright. I don't have time to mess with these people. I gotta go see the princess. Get laid. I'm like, what, 10? Yeah. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with that. Except a lot of things, so. Multiple things. A lot of things, yeah. Yeah. Just forget I ever said it, okay? I try to. Look at that beautiful train. How gorgeous. Yeah. It's the, it's the finest wood and one rupee can buy. Do you understand the significance of today? In order to become a train engineer in this kingdom, you must have an audience with a princess. If she grants you her permission, you can finally go down on her like you've always dreamed. I mean, uh, you can finally operate a train by yourself. Now hop aboard onto the castle. Yeah! Good, and let's get going. Oh, but one last thing. You can make sure you wear protection, you know. You don't want to get, like, banners from the kingdom for, like, knocking out the princess while she's underage. Oh, I mean, uh, you're gonna drive the train to get us there. Go call your final exam, so, uh, don't, like, worry. It'll be a piece of cake. You've been doing this for how long now? <laughs> You'll need to get us to the castle in 300 seconds. Right now, we're here in a Boda village. No destination. Hyrule Castle is here. There are the trains on the tracks. So be careful not to hit them. The tracks you can drive are dark-colored, and they're off-limits. Okay, you got that? Yes. You yeah, like your confidence, so it reminds you how to operate the train on our way there. So hop aboard. <laughs> it's your first test and your only test. Like, you have no idea how to drive the train going in there. He's like, I'm just a kid. How, wh why am I a train engineer all of a sudden? <laughs> and here we go. We're going to drive a train to the castle now. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and flip that up. Yeah, <laughs> it's it's train it's uh, Legend of Zelda Train Simulator 2009. I think you probably got all this down, but human me will have to tell you again. You know that stuff that you just used before I said anything? Yeah, use that. This is the gearbox. Slide the lever up and down to change the speed. Slide to B to go in reverse. You can use it as an emergency brake too. <laughs> I use that a lot. <laughs> I go full speed and then I just pull it down and it goes. Aah! I'll show you in a second. This is the whistle. Touch it and give it a good pull and blow the train's whistle. I also let you blow my whistle if you know what I mean. <coughs> Again, uh, oh, you can look around by judging the direction you want to look. And good engineers are always aware of their surroundings, you know. <laughs> so you got all that? Yeah. Now set the gearbox to the, the, that ratchet. All right, we already did. Wait, wait. Let's see. <laughs> All right, and we're off. We got 280 seconds to get to the castle. I think we can do it. I have never ran out of time. I, I don't think I've ever even hit any train. I might do it right now and just see what happens. We got animal, we got some piggies on the track. Some little bit of piggies. I gotta pull the get ready to pull this lever. 
Just eat them and they start running. Pigs! If you hit a pig while it's on the track, it'll uh, damage you once and then it will retaliate and it'll come back and hit you again for a second. Uh, thing of damage. So, Jax, uh, you need to use the rail to switch to decide what direction you want to go. You know, normally you have to have somebody get out and do it with you, but you know, video game logic, yeah, you can do it yourself. This is the rail switch. Slide, slide the handle in the direction you want to go. Use a co the, your course is displayed on the map, too, so check it there. Got it? Yep. From here on, we'll be showing tracks of the trains. Keep an eye on the map, make sure you choose the correct tracks. So, I want to go this way. So, I don't hit that or train. That train is right there? Yeah. Yeah, you don't want to hit those. That's bad. That's bad news. Just like in real life. You don't want to hit another train while you're driving one, you know? Yeah. You might lose your job, you might even lose your life. I don't know which one's worse, you know? I'll lose your job. You think losing your job is worse? Yeah, yeah, my, maybe. <laughs> I went to school to become a train engineer! I don't have expertise in literally anything else! <laughs> I can't do anything. <laughs> my life is ruined. If you lose your life, you won't have to worry about your job. Hey, for this bitch to pass. Now let's keep going. <laughs> I like doing that double pull for some reason. Cause that's like, like uh, the classic train thing. <laughs> when you're a kid, you know? Gosh, how old was I when this came out? Uh, I know I got it for Christmas. I got, I got the game brand new and I got the player's guide with it too. And uh, this is actually the first game I 100% completed. And then I got stupid and decided to use a Game Shark. You know what a Game Shark is, right? No. Uh, you put cheat codes in, and it'll let you like hack a game and use cheats in the game. Uh, I got my place. I got myself stuck in a part. Oh, I might want to slow down. Okay, there we go. Eh. Okay, yeah, we're good. All right, yeah, I got myself stuck and got to a place where I could not get back out. And so that entire file was done. I couldn't do anything else on it. <laughs> I'm like, that'll teach you not to not to use cheats in a game, kids. All right. Come on, come on, come on! I gotta get the prince. I gotta meet the princess. Lame ass train. There's a tower of spirits. Pretty cool thing. You could see it blow up uh, soon. Uh, am I spoiling? I'm, I'm probably spoiling. It's pretty cool though. Yeah. All right, we're almost at the castle. Use the lever on the gearbox to stop the station. I do what I want. Go ahead and run into that train. I ain't got time to wait. Am I gonna hit it? Am I gonna hit it? Am I gonna hit it? I'm gonna hit it. I'm gonna hit it. I'm gonna not gonna hit it. Okay. Did you get the train? Oh god, stop! The <laughs> <laughs> I gotta stop right here. Got it. Well, I made it. Got a little bit past it. Whatever. Good job! You passed the exam with flying colors. Alright, we're here at Ca Rival Castle Town. Castle Town. You, go to, uh, you got us to Castletown, and you know what else? You look good handling a train for your first time. That's the surest uh, sign that you're gonna make a great engineer. <laughs> what do I know? I just, uh, I'm a descendant of a fucking pirate, so yeah. We drove ships, not fucking trains. How does that, does that stuff even. Whatever. Hands to the north. You can't mess it. Good luck now. Alrighty. What do you have to say? Hey there, Link. So I hear your graduation is today. Oh, wait. Hey. You know, I, I've always had a lot of respect for engineers. Thanks to them, we can go anywhere we want in the kingdom. Plus, they even transport our guns to different places for us. Yep, when you graduate, I'm sure you'll take me out for a spin somewhere. By the way, do you know who built these railways? People say they've been here since before they came, we came to this land. But how can that be? You're an engineer, right? Do you know anything about this? I do. What, is that you say? The tracks were built by the spirits of good? Where do you get these crazy ideas from? <laughs> I don't know why I went. 
I saw that guy had a huge nose, so I had to give him the uh, the nasally thing like Squidward has in SpongeBob. Yeah, that's why I did that. Yeah. And I gotta meet up with this douchebag. But he doesn't even have wings. I don't know. He's a douchebag. Yeah. Look at the way he runs. Oh wow. <laughs> no, I have a, I have a gift. I could just look at someone and tell if they're a douchebag. So. Hey, 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 howdy, mister. Me? Oh, I'm no good at long-winded introductions. I'm just an average guy who works the postman gig to get by. You can call me the postman. All my friends do. I don't even have a name, actually. Now that you know my name, that's not really my name, whatever. Next time I see you, don't be sorry, I say hello. Speaking of names, you're Nate Link, right? I watch you through your bedroom window every single night. <laughs> <laughs> I got a letter for you, so I'll just jump right in and read it aloud. Oh, wait, that's the way we used to do things. AKA Spare Tracks. I mean, Pin of Class. But no more. Apparently, some folks thought I was reading their letters out loud was rude. There's a whole thing about the in Phantom Hourglass, uh, which we'll see it later. There was a mix up, and the letter was delivered to me and read out loud, and it wasn't meant to be for me. It was like some sort of love letter. <laughs> <laughs> so now our policy is to just hand deliver the mail unopened. Here you go. We got a letter for the postman. You got a letter for the postman. Go to the collection screen and read it. Okay, I'll deliver your mail safely to you. Well, my work seems to be done here, so I'll be off. See you around. Look at that. Fucking power walking. Alright. What is it, kid? We're kind of busy protecting Hello Castle right now. If you've got no business here, I suggest you scram. What's that? You here for the engineer graduation ceremony? No, sir. What? <laughs> then why are you talking to me? Can you see I'm busy? Go on, get lost. I'm gonna talk to this dude. Oh, I'm sleepy. I've been standing here since storm. Hey, why don't you stop bugging me and move? Get moving. What is it, kid? I just already said this. Why are you making me say it again? Go ahead and say your yeah. So whatever you you know, just leave the fuck alone. Huh? I didn't know they gave engineer certificates to little kids like you. I guess times are changing. Well, go on in. Righteous. Wow. All right. Hello, Mr. Gartzer. <coughs> the princess's throne room is upstairs. Only invited guests are allowed in. What well, that means is for you. Get lost. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so cheesy. What's all the commotion here? Oh, good day, Chancellor Sokol. I apologize for the disturbance. This boy says he's come to see the princess. It's not so. You're here for the graduation ceremony, but you're so young. What a waste of resources. Spare chucks are vanishing. Yet the princess insists on performing these ridiculous ceremonies. Well, come along, boy. We must get you to your ceremony. Follow me. Don't just stand there, drooling pirate. Move aside. Yes, sir. <laughs> That guy had it. Look at that. Look at the fucking chin that dude has. You can't really see it from this angle, but he had a fucking square ass chin, dude. And there's Tetra. From from Van Uh when we could Van Ogar. I thought Tetra turned into Zelda. Yeah. Yeah. But she again, she preferred being called Tetra. So. Oh. <laughs> and there's a Desana. No. No. It's actually kind of funny. Chancellor Cole is funny. Well, little short little dude you just saw. Yeah. Look at her fucking chin, though. It's funky. Mm. Yeah, it's funky. <laughs> <laughs> it was love at first sight. I knew it had been when I laid eyes on her. Raising your head without permission? You ill mannered urchin! <laughs> Silence, bitch! <laughs> Don't pay, don't pay any attention to Tesh the Cole. You must be the new engineer. What's your name? Link? What the fuck kind of name is that? It's a wonderful name, I guess. Well, Link, by the power vested in me, I hereby proclaim you... You're wasting your time here, your highness. Please hurry up, just hurry up and finish, finish this foolish ceremony. Very well, Chancellor. No, take this certificate or whatever, I guess it makes you an engineer. Thank you, teacher. Now, did you pay off all your student loans? You didn't have any student loans. How the fuck did you learn how to drive a train without any student loans? Our economic system is not really all that well. 
I hereby recognize our newest royal engineer, Link! Work hard, or we all rely on you, Link. You got your you got your royal engineer certificate! Now you're a full-fledged engineer, instead of just a half-fledged like you were before. Look, guys, look, look. Shh, take this. No, don't say a word right now. Oh, wait, I didn't read it in that voice. Shit. Read this later, and beware of the Chancellor. I'm gonna just turn around and walk away like I didn't do anything now, okay? <laughs> See ya! There's so many silvers, so I suggest you move along. Why don't you go polish your train or something? Not that it matters much. The thing will be useless before long. What a douche. Yeah, yeah. He's the king of douches. And Link's just like, well, fuck. And now, first thing I'm gonna do was open up that beautiful letter that princess gave me. Um. Yeah. It smells like roses. I have a great favor that I must ask for you in person. Oh! What did I say? What did I say? What did I say from the beginning? I knew it was going to happen. Follow the secret path at the top of the castle. Tap the map icon to copy the location on your map. Please come to my quarters as soon as you can and don't let anyone see you. Oh, this is going to be good. You know it's going to be good. All right. I, I had an extra look to see where I needed to go, so I'm going to have to go back. Okay. Um. Uh, yeah, blah 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 Okay. 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 Let's go. Alright. Going on an adventure. It's got the... Oh, well. Fuck it. I'll go back to it later. And we're gonna go down all the way. Who the fuck is this little dude? Just cause you're an engineer doesn't give you the right to snoop. Even there are kids like me, though there are places go, you're right supposed to. I hope I get promoted soon. I'm tired of wearing this goofy recruit uniform. You know, all the recruit uniforms, all the soldier uniforms, all the green clothes that Link would wear. And, uh, Link wore in, uh, Wind Waker. Why? Because it's a garb of a legendary hero. Oh. Hey, sir. <laughs> you're not going to do anything about me being there? Alright, fine, whatever. Well, we're going to, um, go up here. And hoppity 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 hop hop down here. All right. All right. We gotta go up here now. Took a little detour around that door. Floor three. He's playing a pan flute. That's an instrument of the game, and you can actually play it. You do need the microphone in this game, but it's got a microphone built into it. So. Uh -huh. I can't use it though. Oh, son of a bitch. I can't. I can't. Uh, Why do you need the microphone? You, you, but the thing is, you tap it and it's like you actually play the wind flute and you gotta blow into the microphone and like move the wind flute and play different notes. The pan flute. Yeah. They have to do that on the game? Yeah. Did any of the guards see you on the way? No. Great, get undressed. <laughs> Listen, you're the only one who can help me. Apparently, it's wrong for girls of my age to have these feelings. I have a favor to ask you, Link. As you know, the Tower of Spirits has protected our kingdom for ages. The tower connects this, all of the spirit tracks that crisscross the land. However, for some reason, they seem to be vanishing from everywhere. Something must have happened to cause all this. I must look out there to investigate. I heard tales of a sage who guards our land and lives in the tower. Perhaps she might be able to shed some light on what's happening. Chancellor Cole forbids me from leaving the castle due to safety concerns. But I think he's just a little bitch. I think he just doesn't want me to go to the tower, though. But why? It's clear he's hiding something. I mean, who the fuck wears two hats? I'm feeling something terrible is about to happen. That's why I absolutely must get to the tower. I'll do anything! Anything? <laughs> <laughs> mm, okay. Thank you so much, Link. Alright, please put this on right away. It's a recruit uniform. The guards are starting their patrols, so getting past them won't be easy. But if you wear this, they'll think you're one of them. You got the recruit uniform. Wearing this, you can pose as a soldier. We're freely about the castle. Please
please get changed so we can move on? Oh, I, I'm sorry, I looked the other way. <laughs> but please hurry. Is she secretly looking? Probably. <laughs> it looks good enough, I suppose. <laughs> Bitch, I look pretty fucking stellar in this thing, man. I look fucking legendary, if you know what I mean. Uh, now let's go before the guards find us. All right. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that next time on Gaming Center Live. But until then, this is the gamer and Randall saying so long and go play some beer games. And remember to save after you do. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. <coughs> Got anything to say, Randall? No. Nope. Yeah. Okay. See you guys in the next one. All right.